Good late morning, everybody, and welcome to Legacy Field in Carlson Stadium, the season finale for American Rivers Conference football. My name is Darren Swenson as the Luther College Norse play host to Nebraska Wesleyan. Both teams come in with 1-8 and eight overall records on the season. The Norse are 1-6 in conference play. Nebraska Wesleyan is 0-7 in conference play. It's a very cold day as November is definitely upon us as the temperature in Decorah right now, 30 degrees. The wind chill is 19 degrees. The wind will be a factor today. Northwest wind today. Side brace Istis goes in motion. The give off the left side in a loose football as a fumble is taken by Luther and they have the recovery. Tristan Myers lost the football and coming out of there with it was Carter Carl Furman. Receivers left and right. Little on a wing right side. Cornwell in the shotgun takes the snap, retreats in the pocket. Here's it out down the left side. Going for Andre Atkins. Makes the catch. Touchdown. Bo Cornwell with touchdown pass number 16 on the season. And half of them have gone to Andre Atkins. 32-yard touchdown pass to the man that was third in the league in yards per catch. Coming in, Andre Atkins. Calling out a line signal as Terry takes the snap, drops back to throw. He's hit, he's sacked! Sam Fine brings him down. Back. Miners to the right of Terry in the shotgun. Terry takes the snap, rushes on. Hit as he throws the left side. And the wounded quail of a pass is intercepted at the 30-yard line. Inside the 30 to the 27. And taking the interception was Aiden. Aiden Hollop Schultz had the interception that time. Cornwell and Damiani form a pistol in the backfield. Give us to Damiani. No, it's a play fake. Screen and a quick slant right side caught by Atkins for the touchdown. Andre Atkins with his second touchdown receiving on senior day. And Luther leads it 13 to nothing. PAT, Hocker puts it down for Cornwell, who puts it up and puts it through. And with 4.42 left here in the first quarter, Luther leads it 14 to nothing. Goes in motion off play action. Terry throws the right side, going for his man. It's picked off at the five yard line and knocked back from there. Believe it was Brandon Dees who picked that one off. It was. A little of the tight end left. Cornwell will take the snap, drops back the throw, fires over the middle, catch made by Atkins, cutting left, brought down at the 36 yard line. Bolted in touchdowns. Morris lead it 14 to 7. Here is the give to Vershawn Brooks. Looks for a hole off the right side. Exploits it. He's to the 40, to the 30, near side 20, 10, 5, touchdown! Vershawn Brooks on a 45 yard touchdown run. And the Norse go up 20 to 7. Fourth quarter. Cornwell hunting for the year. Fifth time today, Cornwell on a fake, throws the right tag, catch is made by Atkins, inside the 30, down he goes at the 26 yard line. The snap went to Cornwell, Atkins came open. Receivers right, two receivers left. Cornwell takes the snap off, play action. The retreat in the pocket, airs it out down the right side, going for his man, catch is made by Espinosa, did he get in? Yes, touchdown! Beautifully thrown football by Cornwell. Espinosa made the catch on the back line of the end zone. Norse back on top with 32 seconds left here in the third. Out of the line. Miners and Terry form a pistol in the backfield. Give to Miners left side. Claps back at the 46 yard line. Matt Canada was there. 
Mafiuatu brings him down as well. In the shotgun formation is Terry. He'll take the snap. Retreating in the pocket. Now steps up in the pocket. Fires down the middle of the field. Picked off of the 39. Running to his right to the 50. Near side of the 40. It's Sam Bundy and he's out of bounds. Fourth takeaway by the Norse today. Including the third interception by Luther Secondary. Lopez in motion right to left to give is to Damiani. No, it's a play fake. They throw the end zone. It's a bomb right catch made by Blake Stormy for the touchdown. Fourth touchdown pass of the day for Bo Cornwell. 19 on the season for him. Cornwell in the shotgun. Takes the staff, retreats in the pocket, throws the left side, catch is made, two-point conversion. Andre Atkins on the receiving end of the two-point conversion. And Luther has the two-touchdown lead, 35-21. Terry takes the staff, rolling to his left side, fires to the left side, nearly intercepted, is it intercepted? No. When the line judge and the field judge are discussing it, it's going to be an interception for Luther. I believe it was Sam Bundy. As not get formation, two tight ends left side of the line. Drop it throws Cornwell. Cornwell rolling out to his right side. Cornwell on the run, fires downfield. Catch is made across the 20. Stormy fighting forward, carrying a tackler across the 25 and knocked out of bounds. At the 29 yard line, it's a gain of 18. Blake Storby on the receiving end. He caught a touchdown on the previous drive. First and 10 from the 25 yard line. Cornwell takes the snap, gives to Brooks. No, the play fake. They throw the right side. Catch by Lopez to the 20. A loose to the defender to the 15. Bounces off the defender to the 10. And brought down at the 8. On the right near number. Side. Cornwell takes the snap. Off the pass left side, the catch is made by one of the big linemen, Darby Jackson, who tries to plow forward, and he'll get as far as the five. Josh Matanich feels it, and that's going to be that. Josh fielding the hop like he's playing first base for Brian Nickel there, and that will seal the victory for Luther. Second and 12, and Hocker down to one knee, and that's that, ladies and gentlemen. 2022 going to end with a victory for the Luther College North.